Let us see how to draw the diagram of human digestive system in easy steps. Let us see the structure and functioning of different parts of human digestive system. Mouth Our digestive system begins with mouth. Teeth, tongue and salivary glands help in chewing and swallowing of food. Salivary glands When we eat something, Salivary glands secrete a fluid called saliva. It makes the food soft and also digests the food partially with the help of some enzymes. The saliva contains an enzyme called salivary amylase that breaks down starch which is a complex molecule to give sugar. Tongue the tongue helps in mixing the food thoroughly with saliva. Esophagus Food that is chewed well is passed into the stomach through a long pipe called esophagus. The lining of esophagus has muscles that contract rhythmically in order to push the food forward. The rhythmic movements of the muscles of esophagus are called peristaltic movements. Stomach 
This stomach is a large organ which expands when food enters into it. The muscular walls of the stomach helps in mixing the food thoroughly with more digestive juices. The gastric glands present in the wall of the stomach release hydrochloric acid, a protein digesting enzyme called pepsin and mucus. The hydrochloric acid creates an acidic medium which facilitates the action of the enzyme pepsin. This acid also kills the microbes that enter our stomach along with food. The mucus protects the inner lining of the stomach from the action of the acid under normal conditions. The food that is churned and partly digested in the stomach is released into the small intestine in small amounts. This release is controlled by a sphincter muscle. Liver Liver secretes bile juice. It alkalizes the food in the small intestine. It also emulsifies the fats and helps in digestion of fats. Pancreas Pancreas secretes pancreatic juice. It has different enzymes like trypsinogen, chymotrypsinogen and amylase etc. These hormones help in the complete digestion. Small intestine Small intestine This is the longest part of the alimentary canal which is fitted into a compact space because of extensive coiling. The small intestine is the site of the complete digestion of carbohydrates, proteins and fats. The secretions of liver and pancreas and intestinal wall help to complete the digestion. The walls of the small intestine contains glands which secrete intestinal juice. The enzymes present in the intestinal juice convert the proteins to amino acids, complex carbohydrates into glucose and fats into fatty acids and glycerol. The digested food is absorbed by the walls of the intestine. The inner lining of the small intestine has numerous finger-like projections called villi, which increase the surface area for absorption. The villi are richly supplied with blood vessels which take the absorbed food to each and every cell of the body. Large Intestine The unabsorbed food is sent into the large intestine where more villi absorb water from this material. The waste is removed from the body through the anus. The anus is controlled by anal sphincter. These are the different parts of the human digestive system. Thanks for watching. Please like the video. Please share this video with your friends. Please subscribe to Great Booster channel. Press the bell icon to get all the latest updates. Check the description to find links of other useful videos. Check the end screens for our new videos.